Hello, guys. Uh, I hope all of you are fine. So, in this new series, which I'm going to begin today, I'm going to uh, walk uh, all of you uh, through uh, you know process of how you can create your own custom tabs in the Office ribbon in your Office application. Okay. So, uh, uh, so if you if you are writing some VBA programs and you want your controls to be placed into your own custom ribbon in the Office application. So that those subroutines and functions can be triggered from there, you can you know achieve that uh, if you follow my videos. Okay, so now uh, uh, in in this, let me also make one thing clear. So the process which I am going to explain using this, you will be able to customize the ribbon for app, office applications like Excel, Word, and PowerPoint, but not for office applications like Outlook or MS Access, right? Why? Because uh, you know, it will, you know, uh, uh, because of the structure of these applications itself. So they, they, they do not have files. Like Excel will have file, but Outlook will not have files, right? So in, uh, you know, if you want to customize the ribbon for Outlook and MS Access, then you will have to go through the route of uh, com addings, right? So uh, we will skip that. We will continue and see in that in this video series how you can customize the office ribbon for excel specifically in this uh, in the video series and the same applies for how you can do it for word and powerpoint also so um, in this context context let me i have put together this word document where i have uh, you know given small small pieces of xml codes that will be required and i will you know walk you through as i use them uh, to you know do the office customization but before i do that i have you know uh, studied and learned about it from this link so this is for uh, it, this link belongs to microsoft office documentation page right and from there also you can directly go and read through the entire documentation and understand the process of how you can customize the office okay and this is simple but i have already done the heavy lifting for you have understood everything and I'm going to explain everything in a very easy way in this video series, right? So that's it guys. And I will be uploading this file to some, uh, you know, somewhere uh, to uh, Google Drive or OneDrive. And I will share the link with you guys so that you can download and use these uh, XML, you know, codes, uh, you know, you know, when you are doing it, when you are customizing your ribbon. So don't worry about that. Uh, so just just uh, follow along the video series guys and thank you so much for watching it do like it uh, if you like these videos and subscribe my channel for more such videos it will really encourage me to keep going uh, okay thank you guys thank you so much for watching this see you in the next video bye